This week, colleagues from the DLR Institute of Transportation Systems, DLRTS, are not stuck in traffic jams in Berlin, but in the Chinese city of Hafei, with a population of 8 million. After successful projects in megacities such as Shanghai, the team is again on the road in China to improve the quality of life of millions of people through innovative transport, mobility and environment management. Since the first collaborative projects with China in 2001, the economy has grown enormously, leading to a repeated rise in living standards. As a result, the cities and therefore also the level of traffic have grown rapidly. Traffic comes to a standstill for hours at a time and over long distances. The air is still needlessly contaminated with exhaust fumes and pollutants. In Hafei, the Chinese urban planners, traffic managers and decision makers from the world of politics, business and science are excited about meeting the DLRTS team. They know about the encouraging story of many years of successful collaboration with DLR in China. I believe Huainan is the first city where the tailor-made DLR innovation package is being used to get its huge traffic and environmental problems under control. Thanks to the DLR team's intercultural competence, it was able to gain many years of invaluable experience, bring in new technological ideas and celebrate transdisciplinary successes in China, which is regarded as being the most dynamic and creative soil for innovation in the field of urban mobility worldwide. After the millennium, Chinese scientists first turned to DLRTS in order to avert massive traffic problems in the cities of Ningbo, Beijing and Hafei, which due to targeted urbanization were growing faster than cities elsewhere in the world. The team in Hafei has already been working for a long time on systems to monitor crossroads with cameras in order to optimize the flow of traffic, avoid accidents and improve the safety of transport users. The crossroads monitoring developed by DLR takes an even more detailed look at the traffic and can predict where the vehicles will be located in the next milliseconds. As a result, the system can predict where accidents might occur and identify hazard zones at crossroads that endanger life. All this data is prepared for the operators of the traffic management control centers using artificial intelligence and presented with suitable online information tools. For the traffic police on the ground in the megacities, being able to recognize acute hotspots in real time at a single glance in order to then take precautionary measures is a huge improvement. The modules of the DLRTS solutions are always updated with new development and findings and so an up-to-date and state-of-the-art traffic and mobility management is possible. We want to expand the collaboration, develop new projects and solutions, and help people create an environmentally friendly and sustainable future. Get on board. Let's become partners. Let's work together to develop solutions for the future. We look forward to a successful collaboration. <laughs>